Hello everyone, welcome to another RPG Maker dev request. This is Project NDE by Zemdev. Um, well, let me check. It's a little loud. Um, yeah, that'll work. Animation speed. Oh geez, um, no auto dash. That's a bit of a pet peeve of mine, but... Alright. You have heard of it, have you not? The realm of the malformed. It is known to many catechists. True to its name, it is a cursed land, a cursed land far beyond salvation. As a fast-spreading scourge spreads across the world, its people lose their very forms. know anything about this game, but I remember the dev telling me that, like, Off was an inspiration. I can certainly see that in these character designs. <laughs> kind of reminds me a little bit of Space Funeral, too, of how, like, weirdly they're shaped. This is why you are here. You must find the source of this plague and snuff it out at its roots. Will you be the one to achieve this goal, I wonder? mission is simple. If you are to find the source of the malformed curse, uh, you must seek out each ruler of the three districts of Ka uh, Catechus. When they are destroyed, the source will reveal itself. Knowing what is asked of you, will you face disorder? Sure. Good. Then let us begin. This is your vessel. Give it a name. Bug. <laughs> Why not? You chose to recognize this vessel's true name. Your dedication is admirable. Through this vessel, you will brave hardships and grow in power. Through this vessel, you will seek help from others who may lead you, um, who may lend you their strength. And through this vessel, you will not betray us. It is good that you understand. This is a. This is one name. There is one named Judex who can help you. Find him so that it may, um, it may ease your burden. See to it that you do not fail. Alright then. I okay, I gotta say, I don't like the, the like menu sound effects. Like they're very like sharp compared to like <laughs> the soft like background music. I don't know. We'll see what we got. Oh meters. Is meter oh meter is TP. Swap the user's weapon from a blade, a cannon, and a spear. Okay. We actually start with some stuff. Amps and like Mark One. Is this character like a robot or something? Like. <laughs> okay, fair enough. We got a quest log. I almost want to turn that down. Like, that is actually like, kind of messing with me, just how loud that is. <laughs> Alright. Would you care to explain what you're doing here? Bird? Bird? That's ridiculous. Do you, I really look like a bird to you? Yes. Okay, our protagonist can talk, too. While most, uh, while most would address me properly, you have decided not to. Your lack of respect is indeed quite refreshing. Now then, would you care to explain what it is that you're, uh, you're doing here? I've been sent here. I'm looking for the one named Judex. Oh, curious. What do you want with him? Information. I see. Very well, then follow me. Try not to fall behind me. Oh. What was that? Did I just open up the main menu from a cutscene? <laughs> Alright, here we go. Oh wow, I like the, the like art style of this. We actually start with a little meter. Not enough to do anything though. Ooh! Oh, there we go. Abandoned key. 
in points are a currency. Wonderful, let us proceed. Okay, you're not in my party. So, there you are. As I'm sure you can see, ahead uh, of you seems to be a rather formidable foe. I've taken the liberty to provide you with some equipment. You'll find it in those containers, good luck. That reminds me, you should have these. Basics of battle. Vessel volume. I believe these will be quite useful for so uh, someone like you. Okay, um... A blade, a spear, and a cannon. This seems to me the most well-rounded one so far, so I'll just go with the blade. Oh, it's a bestiary! Oh wait, no, it's... It displays every weapon? In, like, NPC? That's kinda cool. Huh. Oh, okay, so the blade is the, um, the all-around weapon. Or is the, uh, the balanced weapon. Does not hold notable offensive power. Grants user great agility. Huh. Oh, wait. Okay, there's auto battle in this game. I, you know, honestly, I don't think I've ever used an auto battle feature in one of these. <laughs> okay. Is sleep fighting just run away? Huh. Okay. <laughs> And those are save points. All right. Oh, you can move diagonally. That's also kind of unique. <laughs> A good choice. Okay. We didn't have a weapon before, but like, let's just let's just keep using this. That still does good damage, and they do no damage to me. And there we go. Well done, well done. That was quite impressive. Off you go now. There's plenty of work ahead of you. What are you staring at me for like that? That was a but a joke. To say you have a readable expression would be quite the lie. You're still here? Don't you have something to do? Oh, hello again. <laughs> Allow me to congratulate you on the commendable effort of getting here. You have proven your compa uh, capabilities to me, so allow me to reward your efforts. I believe I never properly introduced myself, so allow me to remedy that. My name is Judex. I have been awaiting your arrival for quite some time. Now, I would like to apologize for not revealing my identity to you at first. In these times, it is simply a precaution I must take. However, as you are, um, are the one who I, who I was expecting, I am sure that both of us can leave this uh, in the past. Now then, my instructions are to direct you, and so that, um, and so that is what I will do. I suggest that you meet with me in the City of Red. 
The passage to District 1 will take you there. It has been treacherous lately, but since you are a vessel, uh, there shouldn't be any trouble on your way. You are now entering <laughs> District 1. God, I love just the style of this game, you know? Like, <laughs> this is the reddest district I've ever seen. <laughs> Okay, so the scheme has on-screen encounters. You know, let's try this mechanic. Meter. So I just swap to a different weapon in the middle of battle? Oh, that uses up my turn, though. Okay. So this is a speed-oriented one. I think I was outspeeding these enemies anyway. So maybe that's not going to be super useful. Oh god, I should probably run from these. Oh. Uh oh. <laughs> It's a really fun, funny sleeping animation. <laughs> um, oh, I can retry the battle for like a money cost. That's kind of cool. Oh, you're new. Worklops. Oh, that's... I might have to go back there later. What are you? Informant. Hello. You have business with me. Tell you something? I think not. You seem to be a more materialistic one, so allow me to present you this. When we next cross paths, um, relay to me what you have learned from it. Red slip of paper. I can't read that. I learned to self-heal, and I got this. Okay, there are multiple party members in this game. That's yeah, simple enough. It seems we cross paths again. Have you by chance figured a way out of here? It would appear that I am lost.
have a full meter, but to be frank, I, I just kind of like the weapon I have now. Thunderbolt. We saw those television enemy enemies use this. Low power lightning spell. Okay. You aren't lost too, are you? That'd be troublesome for the both of us. Okay, we can now one-shot those things. Oh, I learned something else there. You're already, are you? You're quite resourceful. Come along now, the city isn't very far. Oh, d okay. <laughs> oh, these look neat. Um... <laughs> I'm gonna heal myself first. That's just a health kit. Intruder. Wait, they just lost health automatically. Am I not supposed to do anything for this fight? I'll defend one last time. If nothing else happens, I'll start attacking. No, they're they're just losing health. Oh, okay. Huh, I thought that was going to be like a boss or something. Surprised they gave me experience. Interesting. It seems you've read my letter. Now then, tell me what you've learned. Very well. Tell me what you remember. Oh. Wait, I was supposed to be able to read that. <laughs> uh, I don't know. It would seem that you were incorrect. Feel free to try again. Let's see if I can get, like... There must be a code for this somewhere. Hmm. Okay, well, whatever. <laughs> Maybe I'll come back to that later. I'm supposed to be busy. Please leave me alone. Okay, I'm okay, thanks. Quite desolate, isn't it? Believe it or not, there used to be many, many more than uh, that lived here. It is quite unfortunate, really. I'm waiting for you to, to transport, or for the transport. I couldn't be better. I couldn't be better. Huh. You're not from around here, are you? Me neither. I'm up in District 2. Good to know a fellow traveler. It's a rare sight these days. It would seem that you've finally arrived. I take it you come, uh, you've come you come to understand this place, correct? In a way, I see. I, uh, I know what they told you. That this world is stricken with an irredeemable curse. 
that you must destroy everything and never look back. But it is not that simple, not by any means. Do you understand what I am saying? We can fix this dying world without wiping the slate clean. If I can reach the source of this world's plight, I will have a chance at fixing everything. This was something I could not do alone, but your arrival has finally made it a possibility. Beyond this point lies the ruler of this district with our victory. We will be one step closer to ending this ongoing madness. I trust that you will not disappoint me, for not only my sake, but yours as well. I will be up ahead. Do whatever is necessary for you, uh, for, for you to prepare. Oh. Oh my god, this game really knows style. Like, <laughs> Are you prepared? I guess so, I just saved. <laughs> and Judix joined the party. Okay, I might be a little under-leveled, because he starts at level 10. Res uh, resuscitate. Thunder. A group heal. Snooze. We saw an enemy use that as well. Oh my god, look at his stats, or his uh, MP. Uh, is he a black mage? Y Y'all know I like black mages. Dude, he's just straight up better in every way. <laughs> Beer's Envoy. Weapon for Judex, and only he can equip it. I forgot if you started with... Yeah, you start with, like, other stuff. I can put it on you, but I think I'd rather it be on you right now. Interesting. All right. Oh, right. This is an MV game, so I can just hold down the button to, to attack. Okay. I think I may have, I may have missed something there, too. <laughs> Hello. Whoa! Masked. Okay. Let's try some magic. Hmm. Doesn't really seem to do that much more damage, if at all more damage than our normal attacks. Yeah, his normal attack still does more. I don't wonder what the purpose of magic is then. Like, maybe there are just some enemies that have, like, insane magical resistance or something, or physical resistance. I don't know, I typically love magic builds, but this game hasn't really given me a reason to use magic so far. Okay, there we go. Yeah, encounters are kind of easy enough as is. What, huh? Random encounters on top of on-screen encounter? That's a bit redundant. <laughs> kind of annoying, too. I, I don't know, man. I'm assuming I gotta kill both of these guys. Hitwalker. So is plagued uh, just um I'm assuming that's just poison. Yeah, it's just poison. There's no like icon for it though. His eyes seem closed. Is that like the only tell you get? <laughs> oh, and this is one of those games where no, it doesn't say, like, if you're poisoned or not, or if you have a status ailment. Wow, that is a first, um... <laughs> Maybe it's a good idea to tell the player that with, like, an icon or something. I don't know, man. Alright, let's, let's move on. Yeah. 
Yeah, the eyes being closed is the tell that um that they're poisoned. That is extremely subtle. Is there no way to remove it? You have no meter skills, I just wanted to check that. Words are scrawled across the slate. The history of our world. While we do not know where our beautiful world was created, we know that uh, we have observed its glory and honorability call, um, called ourselves its citizens for hundreds of years. When the day came that he brought us new life, our day of despair finally ended. A new beginning was finally ours to grasp. And so, with this new world in our hands, he took his place at, in the stars to look over us forever. We now live in days of peace and prosperity, and it is all owed to his sacrifice. The inscription ends there. You will prevail. I still don't have a use for money yet. Oh god, that poison is really annoying. Is there really, like, no item that just gets rid of that? You don't have a skill? Why would I want to do that? Looks like I have to heal at least. Um, I wonder if I miss something in this maze. Because I don't know why it would want to warp me back. I still want to find the district's ruler. Let me see again. So, like, up here... Oh, that's a separate way? Okay. <laughs> Didn't really look like it, just by that loadout. Okay, I gotta say, like, the maps in this game kind of bother me. Like, you go up and you, like, come out the right side of a different room. And then, like, the... The, like, location two spaces to the side of it goes to a completely different area. It doesn't really add up, you know? I, I feel like I'm gonna get lost in this game. I don't know. It would seem we took the wrong path. Correct. Okay, so we gotta do an encounter if we do the wrong path.
Oh, hold on. Oh, there's an all enemies option? That's kind of cool. <laughs> oh wow, it's even worse when you hit all enemies with it. <laughs> I feel like normal attacking is still the way we should go. I don't know, man. Well done, we should make sure to be more cautious. What about this way? Nope. Ah, same in cat. Can I run? No. You know, let's try a different weapon. Use the cannon. I gotta say, again, I don't really see much point in, like, the special moves when just attacking, like, just works with everything. Also, isn't my, um, my, uh, like, meter ability supposed to swap when I have a different weapon? Huh, I wonder what happens if I were to use this, um, when I don't have the weapon available. I don't know. Nope. Okay.
think this is the only way I haven't gone yet. Through the wrong path may be chosen, there is still hope found in failure. Oh, we got a maze area? Really? <laughs> These always annoy me a little bit. I'm not sure if that's, like, telling me I should, like, look in that wrong area a little more. I gotta say, putting a Lost Maze area right at the start of the game is not really a good luck. <laughs> These are notoriously kind of annoying. At least I don't have to do an encounter, like, after each one. Do I have to go back at that moment? I do. Oh god, okay, hold on, hold on. I'm gonna get a notepad out. Okay, okay. The top right. And then up, right, down. No, um, right, up, down. Okay. And then right again? Nope. left. Hold on a second. The music has kind of gone away and all I hear now is the bell. Maybe that's a clue for where I gotta go. Oh no, that's just part of the soundtrack. I thought maybe this is like an audio <laughs> puzzle for a minute. Maybe this is a clue? That doesn't look like one. Um... Wow, okay. Buddy, you can't put a puzzle- you can't put a Lost Woods section in the first, like, half hour of the game, just saying. <laughs> hmm. Well, there we are. I think we have, like, the first boss coming up now. Just ahead is the source of the district's power. I would like to believe that we are prepared to face what lies ahead, but I would have to say we are quite lacking in manpower. Perhaps checking with the locals and shopkeeps may help us. We will need whatever um, whatever help we can get. So, like, go back? Can I do this right now? What we're looking for is just up ahead. I, I'll do. I'll try this right now. I just saved. <laughs> you know, wasn't the story of off? It's been a while since I played off. But wasn't the story of that game that you had to like? Go to like three districts and like defeat the boss in each one too. <laughs> That's who we've been looking for. The thing. You are correct. That is what rules over the district. And it seems like the curse has fully taken root uh, root on, in this one. If you are adamant as you uh, as your predecessors, I would certainly appreciate your help here. 
Well, let's try this anyway. An ornament atrocity. Uh, let's fish for a weakness first, I guess. Zero damage. Wow, okay, just go back to normal fighting. So, like, what is the point of magic exactly? Like, it doesn't do more than attack and is straight up immune- and this bosses like this are straight up immune to it. Also, that did a lot of damage. Um... Maybe I am supposed to go back and, like, look for more party members or something, but this feels possible, you know? Especially if you just keep using poison on the same character. I kind of like this boss theme so far. Memento Mori. I don't know what that does. Okay, I gotta say, I got very mixed feelings on this game so far. I really love the style. And, like, the story is kind of cool, but, like... I don't know, like, some of the design aspects I find very annoying. Like, the fact that, like, none of your magic or, like, alternate, like, um, abilities or seem to really do much. Let's switch to the sword, just so I can, like, see what that does. You never know. Like, the magic does less than your normal attack? That's not how it's supposed to work. <laughs> Like, swapping to, like, I don't know, it isn't, like, a thing where, like, your character has completely different, like, abilities. It, the, the game said you were supposed to have different abilities when you swap weapons, but you kind of don't, which is strange. I don't know, like, I, I think the dev told me this game was, like... Does that even do more... Hold on. Oh, okay. That's an instant kill move. Um... Those are really unfair, by the way, especially when you only have two party members. I mean, it does a little bit more, but, like, I might as well just swap to the can if I'm going for raw attack. Because that doesn't even cost anything. I did not mean to auto there. Uh, hopefully you'll heal? No, okay. <laughs> I overestimated... <clears throat> I overestimated auto. Or auto moves. Here, go back to the to the cannon. That one actually like does a lot of damage. And then you get stuff like putting a lost mazed area like right at the start of the game. <laughs> I don't know, like, I love the style of this game, I just wish, like, it was a bit more baked, you know? <laughs> then again, I think the dev did tell me that this game is, like, early in development. Like, it's not completed yet, it's only a couple hours as of right now, and... I gotta say, this is a phenomenal start. Like, I, 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 I've noticed this a few times, I feel like you have a really good game on your hand where, like... The worst things about it are, like, schematic stuff like that. Because, like, you know, stuff where you could just fix it by, by, like you know, making bosses do less damage, or, like, making certain attacks do more damage or something. Also, I don't remember your... Oh, my God. Stuff like this, too, is kind of unfair, by the way. Like, uh, instant kill attacks I typically don't like, but, like, when you only have two party members, it just isn't friendly. <laughs> I do like the idea of the first boss being, like, poison-based, though. That's kind of cool. I just... Oh, my God. I just don't like these... I just don't like skills like this. Oh? Oh no. It's not insane, like, 
raise in defense. Sharpen. So I take it like since you're at like low health, you're doing like a second phase now. Oh, your your um your uh, defense bus went away. Can you only have one at once? Oh no. Oh come on. Those buffs really don't last that long. Gullatine. Is, don't- oh no, I was gonna say, that better not be another instant kill attack. bug back to life whenever I want to, because Ju uh, Judex has Resuscitate. Does that stack? Yes, it does stack. I like that the, the little icon just adds more swords. <laughs> Okay, you cannot die from slip damage. That's good to know. Restore yourself. Yeah, I can't have Bug do it, because... Yeah, you go first. Um, I feel like if I bum rush this fight, I can win it now. Uh, the thing that kind of sucks, like, is... This fight does seem, like, semi-up to luck, because he has not one but two instant kill attacks. Like, I can't emphasize enough just how bad of an idea that is, like, this early in the game. Because, like, the only character with a revive skill is Judix. So, like, if, if he does that on Judix, I just... I only have Bug now because I used up all the, all the revives and then, like... Huh. I don't know. Like I said, like, <laughs> it's... I love the style of this game. I just feel like a lot of these fights and, like, some of these dungeons just aren't really that well done as of right now. But, like... It's at a point now where it could really easily be like, um, <laughs> be like, uh, be like remedied and like, the, I don't know, man. Oh my god, did I level up? I leveled up four times from that. I think I was really underleveled for that. <laughs> Fury Rush, Multi Thunder, and Multi Flame. Amb ambivalence. Did I sequence break the game? Because that, that. <laughs> Leveling up four times kind of tells me maybe I was meant to, like, actually go back to the town and come back here to do stuff, but... God, I don't want to do that, uh, that mission, or I don't want to do that maze again. What are you waiting for? Finish it. Oh, you again. Well done, Bug. You have performed your duties to the letter. Know that we are satisfied with your work and that we look forward to what your future endeavors may bring. However, I'm afraid for the time being, your story is at an end. Goodbye, Bug. We'll be waiting. Ice? Ice sequence broke, didn't I? Because <laughs> the dev told me the game takes about two hours to complete, but we're only at 50 minutes right now. Oh my god, you really were supposed to go back to that town, weren't you? Let's go back to the town real quick. 
I'm not gonna like redo that area again, but like I want to see if like maybe you are meant to get more party members here, or maybe there are more battles or something. <laughs> The creatures out there seem to attack anything and everything these days. It's a shame, they aren't like us, and they are they attack mostly anything they see. I noticed that they seem to be especially attracted to things they consider a threat. Tons of them tend to show up. It's not much of a problem for me, since I can just slip by them without when I have to. Hope they weren't too much of a problem for you. Any minute now. No, these guys don't seem to say much different. Informants Index. Oh, hold on. I think... Yo, okay, okay. Hold on, hold on. 7, 14, 21, 24, 25, 26. This is the alphabet. Okay, then. Let me take a picture of this with my phone. Oh god, okay, these are my types of puzzles. I love puzzles like this. <laughs> now, where was the informant? Was it in that area, or that dungeon? Oh. Let's go a little farther and see if we can find him again. I want to see if I can, like, complete this. At least, like, this puzzle, you know? <laughs> I think it was up this way. Oh wait, no, this is the Lost Maze again. You know, I feel like the giving the player the ability to go back through those same portals might be nice too. Like, I don't know, maybe after you use one for the first time, like, another one would spawn that would allow you to warp back to, like, where you warped. Or to, like, where you came from. You, you, okay, you. Well, let's take the letter, then. Foreman's letter. Alright, let's see what we got here. Um... That's a... wait, no. That's a T. God, hold on, let me get my... <laughs> I'm actually gonna be, like, doing this on my phone a little bit. Let's see. So the first letter is a T. Is it the? What's the, like, sideways Y? Is it me? Yeah, it's probably the. So the is the first word. Um, now for the May Borowski symbol. That's an S. Another S. And another S. Okay, we'll do this with, like, Wheel of Fortune way, where I just, like, do one letter at a time. If I see more, I'll put them down. Okay. Now for, like, the open bird mouth thing. That's an I. Any more of those? I see one in the middle of the next word. Uh, now for the weird looking T.
Oh, right there. That's a G. I don't see any more of those. Now for the weird looking age. N? The signs. There's another one of those like on the third or in the third letter too. Okay. Now for this character. Um That's a P, I think. That's an O. The signs... Point? What's the last word? Um... The signs point east. That's what it says. I'm ready. East, maybe? I can't put in the whole character. What signs? The signs in, like, the Lost Maze? Is this a clue for the Lost Mage? Or the, the Lost Maze? Oh, you can go back! Oh, never mind, you thought of that. <laughs> oh, thank you. No, there are no signs here. So that wouldn't really help there. Huh. I'm kind of at a loss. Eh, whatever. Well, that was Project NDE. This is an interesting game, I gotta say. I love the art style, I love the music, I like the story a lot. I think my biggest problems with it, though, was, like, some of the balance with, like, that one boss and, um, this, uh, this, like, area design right here. Like, I don't know if there's maybe just something I'm missing with this. I'm, that's probably what it is, to be honest. But, like, the fact that I can't find, like, in the answers and just have to use, like, trial and error. Like, that's not a good first impression for, like, a first dungeon, I feel. Um, and giving a boss instant kill attacks this early in the game is really unfair as well. <laughs> I feel like I was meant to go back to, like, the first era, the first, like town and like look around or talk to more people but i couldn't really find like any other people who want to join me or something i don't know like it's a weird game it feels very rough right now but i really like what's here and i can see a fantastic game coming from this <laughs> so yeah that was project nde um go check this game out if it looks interesting to you give it a review give this guy some love like it this is i see a lot of potential in this one but yeah there we go i will see you guys later Thanks for watching.